Hi YouTube. Um, it's been a long time and I haven't really been doing videos that much. And really there's a bunch of reasons why. Um, but mostly I just don't think of it. I, I'm doing stuff and then every once in a while I think, oh, I should do a video about this and then I don't. But here's what's happening now. Sherry, I know some of you were thinking, Mark wouldn't last, he's gonna leave. He's gonna leave, it'll be six months. It'll be a year, whatever, two years. Anyway, I'm staying, but Sherry, my roommate, she is not. I wouldn't say she's tired of Hawaii, but it's expensive here. She's on a, she's on a fixed budget. Um, she's disabled. It's not the most handicap friendly place in the world. There's, it's, it's reasonably, but there's a lot of places that aren't handicap accessible and I live in the loudest place in the world so you can hear these trucks and stuff. And it's, and it's not cheap. And also, we both kind of just want to live by ourselves. We've been roommates for so long and it'd be nice to be, be a single person again. Anyway, she's packing her stuff, or really, I'm packing her stuff. I mean, she's going through it and, and sorting through things. This, this is the plan, I guess. Get Sherry um, to Colorado. I'm going to go with her. This stuff here is going to end up having to go on a pallet. We're going to do a little bit. We came here with a U-Pack, um, but she doesn't have quite that much stuff. There's some furniture back there, some things that are hers. Okay, everything's a wreck. A lot of the kitchen stuff is hers. She's got a dresser and a TV, and I guess she's got clothes in the um, closet. Bed is not going to go. It's cheaper to buy a bed um, <laughs> than it is to ship a bed. Beds are huge. You don't want to put one of those on a pallet. So my plan is this corner here is going to be stacked. There'll be two stacks, and those two stacks will represent two pallets. Um, she really wanted to do this on one pallet, but I don't think it's going to fit on one pallet. I'm going to have to get a pallet and boxes, and so I have a month for to make this happen. About the 8th, I'm going to try to get her stuff um, to the shipyard, probably, uh, yeah, to the, to the shipyard, those two pallets. have to rent a truck. Um, for other reasons, I'm selling my car because I need cash, and it is expensive here, and I haven't worked since December. I haven't had a job since December. Um, that's not a problem with Hawaii so much as I'm looking for specific kinds of work. And there was two months in there I wasn't working, looking for work and then I started and anyway, I'm writing an application and I'm working on that app. And anyway, there's a whole other thing, it doesn't have to do with her moving, but it means I've had very little money um, recently. So I'm going to sell my car. I don't really use it very much. I use it to go surf skiing, um, but I'll figure something else out for that. It really isn't a necessity for me. So I might as well just get rid of it. It'll give me a few months play. That is pretty much the extent of uh, this update. I will update you further as things move along. The first milestone is going to be the first of next month which is like two weeks away where I'm gonna put my car up for sale I'm gonna sell one of my surf skis as well just for money reasons just for myself and then the about the eighth I'd like to have her stuff and it's gonna be more than this of course on um, and a pa on a pallet um, on its way to Colorado probably the 15th or so I, Sherry and I will get on a plane, go to Colorado, look for a place for her to live. And um, we do that for, it won't be a, just a hotel room, do that for two weeks, hopefully find something within those two weeks and she can move in. The pallet of stuff probably won't arrive for another week or two after that, um, but I need to make her new place handicap accessible. So put in some railings for the bathroom, uh, for her to get on the toilet, maybe get her a high seat for the toilet. I usually replace the, the um, towel racks with, with actual like railings. So they act as tail racks, but really it's like solid on the wall. So that's what I've done in the past. Same thing here, I did it here. Um, and then some kind of railings or something inside the shower. And we'll look for a place that's a little more handy accessible than this place is. Um, well, this place, the problem is, is that when she scoots in here, she has to make this turn but scooter doesn't make that turn. It's, it's uh, too big. So she's got to get off the scooter, walk into the, into the bathroom. So it'd be nice if we found a place for her where she could just drive the scooter 
straight into the restroom. This is all part of the plan. And that's pretty much it. So the naysayers who thought that I wouldn't stay, uh, I did, I'm still staying. Uh, I, had a, I had a plan uh, for just an evening. It was like, it took me 12 hours to change this plan, but I was thinking of getting rid of this apartment and saving a month's worth of rent. <sighs> and I started sort of freaking out about that because then I'd be, I'd come back to Hawaii and I'd have no place. All my stuff would be in storage in this plan. I hand in the notice, move out of here, help Sherry do her move, stay there for about a month while I get her all set up and her stuff arrives, get her all place set up. And then I would fly back here and I would have to stay with a friend. So I even asked a friend if I could stay. Then a few hours later, I was like, wait, no, no, forget it. <laughs> uh, I can't do that. Um, so I'll spend the little extra money uh, keeping the apartment. Yeah, and I'll have a friend stay here so that it'll be, it won't be empty. Well, anyway, that plan was, um, was no go. I couldn't, there's no way that I, that I could do that. I mean, I, I just, it's just like, I'd just be, I'm forcing myself to be homeless. And if I did that, if I, if I didn't find work, um, in that time, I mean, realize this is, this, we're talking, uh, July 1st that I'd come back. So if I didn't find work, plus I'm writing this app, um, that I'm going to put into the Apple store. And I wanted to put it at the end of this month, but I don't know that I'm going to make it, especially I'm doing all this work. And so running on here, I have all this stuff that I'm working on. If I were to pack all my stuff and put it into storage, then I would have to unpack it and put it into a new place. And I'd have to look for a new place and all of this. I'm taking a lot of my time that I really need to be looking for work um, and getting my app in the store and selling my app and promoting it and that kind of thing. So. I really should be focusing on that. That's where my money is, that's where my livelihood is. I think the app I'm writing is gonna do fine, it's gonna do well. I doubt it'll be tons of money, but you know, any amount is better than nothing, right? So, um, and that's what I've, that's part of what I've been doing with my time when I say I haven't been working. I've actually been programming, I've just been programming my own program. And so, hopefully in a few weeks I'll have that in and hopefully that becomes income it would be great if it was like a thousand or two thousand dollars a month from that app. Who knows what's going to happen? Could be a lot less, but that's kind of my that's my hope. Um, and if it is, then that puts a lot of pressure off of me for how much money I have to make a month in whatever job I'm on. So and that means hours. That means so that's that's what it is for me. Anyway, a lot in this update, but that's pretty much the update. So. That's pretty much it. Here we go. Fire trucks. <laughs>